Bradley Price is a 21-year-old hardware store worker from the New South Wales Central Coast. And he's here today. He's stand up here Thank morning. you. Thanks. With his mum and his partner. Mm -hmm. Bradley is charged with resisting arrest, escaping police custody, and assaulting police. Tend to the facts and record. Police prosecutor, Constable Joseph Pinkerton, presents the fact sheet. The night of Mardi Gras, we had it off to Mardi Gras, me and my partner. i um, have been drinking way too much, and there was an altercation between my partner and I, and he'd gone to police and basically um, accused me of something. Bradley's partner, Jai, complained to police that Bradley was harassing him. I just wasn't very good with the way I spoke to them about it and ended up with three different charges against police, so... Mr Price, stand up. The facts of the matter are that your partner went to police and made some allegations in relation to you. Police, they're duty bound to take any complaints seriously. So they essentially told you to go away and you were trying to persuade them, but really in a bit of an inappropriate way with your language, that uh, he was not well and that you were actually trying to assist him things deteriorated and you punched one of the officers in the left chest around the shoulder. When they arrested you, you resisted twisting your body while you were yelling and swearing at police. There was an ongoing wrestle and then eventually they got you uh, handcuffed and then you got up and ran off down the road with police on motorcycles trying to stop you. I know you're only 21, but you've still had a lot of opportunity to get yourself into trouble and you haven't done so. Now I note as well, you've got your partner and your family here, so you've obviously got a supportive environment and you're working and that's another thing that points well in your favour to rehabilitation. You've got to have a bit of a think about uh, whether or not uh, you can afford to use those substances and that's particularly the case given that uh, you really need to be in a uh, more supportive uh, situation with your partner. He can't afford for you to be out of control. Do you understand what I'm saying to you? Yes, Your Honour. Today I am going to record a conviction. For sequence one, a fine of $330. For sequence two, a fine of $440. And sequence three, a fine of $440. You're right to go. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much.